We went through the cameras at the gas station and managed to locate everyone possibly exposed to the infection except one, Rachel Anderson. Some checked into the hospital on their own after noticing the hives. Others we found in similar situations as Mr. Griffin. I think it's safe to say whatever this is, it's making them kill. First thing is first, I'm taking every available officer and shutting down every road in and out of this town. I can't risk this thing spreading, not on my watch. Hopefully, by then, we'll find Miss Anderson. I met with the mayor, and he agreed to get in touch with the governor. Unfortunately, we still haven't found Miss Anderson. God help us, I hope she hasn't escaped this damn town. Miss Anderson still hasn't been located, but we do know she was seen at the local grocery store late yesterday. I spoke with Dr. Wells, and he believes there is little chance that this thing hasn't spread to someone else. This is going to get a lot worse before it gets better. I'm worried St. Rock might not make it. The mayor called and told me that an official alert will be broadcasted on January 10th. The governor thinks that will be enough time to mobilize the military and get the CDC on site. I hope they get here soon. Panic is starting to set in. The military has started to mobilize around the perimeter of the town. A team from the CDC arrived. They immediately set up shop at the St. Rock gas station. Hopefully, they'll find something that will help. We finally found Rachel Anderson. She was at her ex-husband's home. Rachel killed him that grounded him up. She fed his remains to the open sores on her body. Rachel wasn't very remorseful. She claimed they went through a very bad divorce and was happy to have found a good use for him. Thankfully, she was cooperative. She walked us through every step from when she left the gas station to the supermarket, pharmacy, local bakery, sandwich shop, and finally to her ex-husband's home. I think it's safe to say the hospital is going to be overwhelmed very soon. And then the morgue. Dozens of people have been admitted. It's only going to get worse as the day carries on. Rachel didn't make it. The details were messy. More people have been admitted. More people that I've known for years are gone. Gone in the most horrible way imaginable. Whatever this is didn't come from God. This came from the devil himself. This thing is getting in my head. I swear to God, it feels like my skin is crawling. I am resigning from my position as Sheriff of St. Rock. I have been infected with the itch. I'll be admitting myself into the hospital before the worst of it takes over. I know how this is going to end, and I'm terrified. Hello, my name is Prophet, and what the hell do you want?